All right, boys and girls, welcome back to another video. As you can see, just woken up, but we've done the bed already. Gotta make sure you do that first thing in the morning. It is Thursday, and today I'm gonna to be doing a couple things. One of the biggest things is the title of this video is the beep test, because I've got a bone to pick with one of you guys. On my Premier League fitness test, one of you guys specifically, uh, this comment right here, called me out on the beep test, said, I don't think you're actually doing 14.1, mate. I think you've I think you've edited it and uh, fooled us all. He's called me out publicly and said, if you can prove me wrong, I'll publicly apologize. And today we're gonna make that happen because we're gonna go out, we're gonna do the beep test. Anyway, that's later on. Right now, obviously we've just woken up, got to have some breakfast. I'm gonna go down to the field with a couple of the boys and have a training session in about an hour and a quarter. And uh, yeah, I'll take you throughout the day. We're getting back in the swing a bit. Pre-season is in a couple of days, a couple of weeks. Can't wait to get back. All right, so breakfast done. That's the way we're starting the day now, people. They're not with that cereal vibe anymore. We're on a different thing. Went home this summer, went back to England, and remembered what it's like to live a proper, healthy lifestyle with good food. Shout out to my mum for teaching me, basically. I'm not a very good learner, but I'm trying my best, trying to get those fruit and veggies in. And uh, yeah, fruit salad to start the day is always a good way. Getting at least five, I think I had strawberries, blackberries, blueberries, banana, apple, bit of orange juice on top, and then you get protein yogurt, get a little bit of protein from the clusters, whatever they're called, what are they called? Granola clusters on top. So all in all, a great start to the day. Now I've got about half an hour. I'm just gonna stretch out a little bit because we've been training quite a bit since I've been back. Um, obviously we're not quite in pre-season with the team yet. It's more off-season training. So it's just a couple of us, but my calves have been getting quite tight from the sprints at the end of the sessions that I've been doing. So gonna need to do a proper stretch out before the session. And that's gonna be about it. And then we'll be off to the field to get some training in. As you guys can see, next to all of my good stuff here, we've actually got a little stretching booth. Look at this. This is my plan. Stretch out everything. IT band, I had a bit of problem with that before. And then this is just like stretching every other part of the body. And then this bit is using a resistance band. So uh, yeah, those are the stretches that I try and implement as often as possible. I try my best to keep the body <laughs> nimble, basically. Because as soon as we get back to preseason, it's gonna be double sessions. It's already quite tough on the body getting back right now. And then we have the season and it's just non-stop. I mean, look at this. Games, 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 games. All the way until mid-November, basically. That's gonna be stress, but very important to stretch. So that's my little stretching routine there. Uh, gonna get on and do that now. All right, got changed now into the old gear. We're literally about to leave. Just need to fill this up. This is essential in Missouri weather because it is so hot here. You need to keep so many fluids going through your body because it really just uh, all sweats out. So a nice gallon of water. Water sorted, filled up. Let's get on the way. But just before we get on the way, if you are looking for grip socks, check out Maestro Socks. They've geared me up for the season. They can also help you guys out. $14.99 per pair. If you use the LOCKG10 discount code, it's even cheaper. Very affordable, great grip socks. They do the job, you know. So if you are looking, link will be in the description. Anyway, let's get on the road to training. On the way. Got the tripod, got the water, got everything we need. Weather's actually not too bad today. Like overcast, vaguely warm. So uh, it'll be a nice training session. Let's get to the locker room, see you there. We are back, people. Back in the business.
Head's gone. Head gone. This guy somehow recovered his head. Wind up mode chain. Where's it says? Where's it gone? <laughs> So, dropped it. What's happened here then? Someone's gonna have to shotgun that at the end of the session. <laughs> or now, go on, get it down ya. I think that's going to do it for the little session. Obviously, beep test later, they want to kill the legs. You doing any fitness? Beep, beep test later, baby. That's what I'm saying, beep test later. But you're not, you're not going to do it, are you? Me? Always. On the way back now, good little session with the boysies. Nothing too strenuous, working on touch, you know, a couple pings and that. Consistency, you know, it's key. It's about 12, so midday. Yeah, relax for a bit because it's gonna be raining later on or thunder. So we're not gonna be able to do the beep test until a little later on in the day. So yeah, that is the plan for now. And I'll see you when I get home. Solid. As you can see people, conditions have certainly changed. That's the storm that I was talking about earlier. Hopefully it passes by about four. The idea is to go to the pitch at five and do the beat test then. So we'll see what happens. All right, people, the time has come. It's now 5 p.m. I can hear the church bells singing down the road telling me that it's 5 p.m. It's been raining for a little bit, but it's stopped for probably about half an hour now. So it's gonna be ideal condition. Let's get down to the pitch, get down to the field, and let's do this thing. And prove Navy Squadron Patrol or whatever your name is wrong because I'm gonna do better than 14. Let's do it. We're down on the field, but before we get into it, I wanna dispel any disbelief that I'm gonna be cheating this, all right? We're not gonna have another comment on this video saying, ah, bloody hell, you didn't do that right. So I'm gonna show you everything. The app that I'm gonna be using is right here. You see it in the top left. If you type in beep test on the app store, it's the first or second one that pops up. I've downloaded it, I've not edited it because it's an app, I don't know how to do that. So we're gonna be using that. And as you can see, we're on a football pitch, right? American football pitch, but it's got lines. So this one here is in line. It's in line here. We've got a big orange cone. Then we're gonna walk, right? So this would be five, this would be 10, this would be 15, 
this would be 20 and 22 yards so there we go this cone symbolizes 22 yards that is actually just over 20 meters so we're actually gonna be doing a little bit more so there you go proofs in the pudding people orange cone to orange cone i'm gonna have the tripod seeing the whole thing i'm just gonna speed it up you can skip through whatever you want to do but this is just to prove that i'm doing it properly so we get no haters all right let's get into it i'm gonna do a quick warm-up and then we'll go let's get going Five, four, three, two, one. Lad. Whatever your name is, I appreciate the comment. But don't go guessing me again, son. Put you on blast. Let's go. 14.5. Not bad. My goal today was to be honest with 15. So I've missed out by a decent six or seven. But still, beat last time. Slow progress is still progress. Whew. And it's still recording. Come on. Now, in all seriousness, that's a blow. Any of you guys at home, do what I did. Go on the app store, download the app. It's got the blue cover. I'll just put it up here. Give it a go yourself. Good fitness test. Good to see how your fitness programming is getting you any further or not. So I uh, would recommend it. It's a great way to track progress. All jokes aside, I appreciate the comment from you Navy squadron, whatever it is. I really do appreciate it because otherwise I wouldn't be out here doing it again. So despite all the jokes, I appreciate the comment. Any of you guys do it, make sure you drop your comment below of what your score is and uh, yeah, we'll compare it. Anyway, that is gonna be it for the, I can't even talk. That is gonna be it for today's video guys. Hope you've enjoyed watching it. Make sure you subscribe if you're new. Drop a comment, any comment, because you might get picked up for another video. We'll see. Also, like it if you enjoyed the video. And uh, yeah, it's all fun and games. Do it for the love of the game. See you later.